I have been working all day, every day, and I think I'm getting close to figuring out what your transformation's all about. Lewis, we kind of figured that one out for ourselves. Yeah, for me it was the tails. Was it the tails for you, Cleo? Or... Ease off on Lewis, he's trying to help. Exactly. Science, science is the key that unlocks the door to the mysteries of life. But you don't much care, do you? No. Look, guys, in the next week or so, I am going to have an opportunity to... What, to... Get it. Lewis, speak. OK, there's someone arriving today. She's doing dolphin research at the marine park. Her name's Denman. She did her PhD at 21. Can you believe that? I'm tingling. These days, she's like one of the world's leading experts in aquatic mammalian cellular evolution. If I can tap into her research... And how are you going to get access to a scientist like her, Lewis? I have my methods. No way. You're not going to tell a real scientist about us. Guys, it's me. I'll be careful. What do you mean, real scientist? She can't know about us. What if she wants to dissect us? What if she goes public on us? She's a marine biologist, and she'll have equipment that makes the stuff at school seem like, like toys. If you guys want answers, I need access to it and her research. And how are you going to do that without spilling your guts about us? I was thinking charm. No. Seriously. Come on, guys. All I'm asking is that you trust me. OK. We do need to know what's happened to us. You'll never get to see her anyway. Uh, yes, I will. Cleo? Lois, we're not supposed to be in this area. Oh, talk about heavy duty. What do you think she looks like? She spends a lot of time in the water. Maybe a prune? <laughs> Can I help you? You seen Dr. Demon? Yes, I'm Dr. Denman. <laughs> I'm Lewis, Lewis McCartney. Lewis McCartney, um... Lewis McCartney? Are you the one that sent me 48 emails about the research assistant's position? Yes, I am. <laughs> wow. You must be very keen. Either that or a stalker. <laughs> stalker? <laughs> this is Cleo. This is my resume, if you'd like to take Thank it. Thank you. It's nice to meet you, Cleo. Lewis. Let me say, I find your attitude admirable. Science is the key that unlocks the door to the mysteries of life. So, mind if we take a look at what you're up to? I'm sorry, I'm actually at a crucial stage of something at the moment. But I will take a look at your resume. OK? OK. Bye. 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 <laughs> Dr Denman? Ha! More like Dr Baywatch Bay. What does she know anyway? Well, I googled her. She wrote some important paper as part of a PhD. Mutations in aquatic mammals. She's got a bit of cred. Mm, she got lucky. I bet she's not even a real blonde. <laughs> what? I'm just concerned about Lewis and how he's feeling right now. You should have seen him before. I mean, what if he gets her influence that he tells her about us? And what exactly are you going to say to her, Lewis? Have a little faith, please. All I want is access to her lab. That's it. You're a sucker for a pretty face. Pretty face? Well, you think I noticed whether she was pretty or not? I'm a scientist. Besides, she wasn't that special anyway. Oh, it's her. He's got her number programmed into his phone already. Dr Denman, how are you today? Mm. <laughs> Nervous laughter, not good. Oh, yeah. Is he twirling his hair? Absolutely. <laughs> funny. You're really funny. You've got a great sense of humour. We are in big trouble. Yeah. No, I I'm, I'm ready to do some work experience. Anytime you want me, day or night. Really? I'm counting the minutes. 
Well, I'm convinced. You can't be trusted. What? Lewis, forget about her for a minute. This is us we're talking about. Do not reveal anything to her. Do you understand? We've got a lot riding on this. Dr. Denman. Lewis. Hey. Lewis, meet Marge. Marge has helped me out with some research too. Isn't she beautiful? Oh, yes. Okay. Can you take this for me? Yes, I can. Can you? Give me a hand with this. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. I can do that. Thank you. Oh, thank there. you. Okay, now let me show you where you'll be working. So, my work in the Galapagos Islands took a bit of a left turn, and that's how I ended up studying cell mutation in mammals. Who knew it would generate so much? interest in whew, the scientific oh. community. Incredible. I beg your pardon? Hmm? Oh, oh this, this equipment, I, I've read about it, but it's, it's wow. Mm-hmm. Well, this is what you get when people throw money at your next research project. It's fantastic. So which piece am I on? <gasps> the electron microscope. No. The ion evaporator. <laughs> the atomic absorption photometer. How about we start with the mop? <gasps> you mopped floors. And that helps us how exactly? Guys, I know what I'm doing. I have access to a lab. All I need now is a fresh DNA sample. Say. A toenail clipping? Okay, okay. Uh, I just missed uh, a couple of bench tops. I thought I'd come back and, and get them done. Very thorough. Okay, well, I'm kind of in the middle of something, so. Oh, yeah, yeah, well, don't let me stop you. I'm sure I can handle a few old bench tops. Okay, I'll leave you to it. All right. I was just... Hey, relax. I knew you couldn't resist. Bench tops, please. So what are you looking at? Oh, nothing. Just something that I found at the beach. It's, it's sand or something. It, it's nothing special. It's just... There's no such thing as nothing special. Everything has its own story to tell. Ooh, is that the time I, uh, I gotta get to school? <laughs> What have we here? Oh my gosh. Dr. Demon, I think I left my... my Your um... slide? Hmm. I know it's not San Luis. 
In fact, I'm not sure what it is. Uh, it's... it's a private project. Okay. It's fine. So, oh. listen, um, I'm doing another dive tomorrow and I need some assistance. Feel like doing some work experience? Oh, yeah, that sounds cool. I'll see you then. Okay, yeah. Lewis, she saw the sample. How could you? You're not getting the big picture. It was an accident. And besides, she's a scientist. This is what scientists do. So, like, they're friends? No, compare notes. That's a thing about us. Us? But we scientists. Our need to know is what drives us, believe me. She's cool. What if her need to know ends up with her dissecting us? She's not like that. I have to go. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Lewis isn't usually this erratic. Those in favour of not trusting Lewis as far as we could throw him, raise your hands. Agreed. Let's keep an eye on him. Science isn't just about satisfying your own curiosity, Lewis. It has to have a purpose. It has to be better for everyone. Oh, oh yeah, I'm so totally there. I mean, only science can change the world, Dr. Hammond. Lewis, please. If we're going to be working together, call me Linda. Linda? Why? It's my name. Oh. Oh. So, we need all this stuff? <laughs> yep. We use most of this stuff today. The other cool thing about science, Lewis. All the toys are out. <laughs> so, where are we heading? I was thinking Mako Island. Mako Island? Ah, uh, that's not a good idea. There's nothing to see at all. And it's full of sharks. Lots of beer. Come on, Lewis. Don't tell me you're afraid of sharks. Me? No, no, not at all. Uh, Mac Wallen's fine. Good. He's nuts. He is completely nuts. How can he take her there? We've got to get there before them. Notice you guys spying on me? I mean, where's the trust? The trust? I think it died when you accidentally gave our DNA to a world-renowned marine biologist. No, no, I think it was when he agreed to take Dr. Baywatch Babe on a date to Mako Island. You've gone too far, Lewis. You don't trust me. After everything we've been through. I've been working so hard trying to solve basic questions about, about why you guys are the way you are, and this is what it comes down to. They're our lives, Lewis. We're being careful. Maybe you should be too. Do you want to know what I think? I think you guys are a bunch of kids. And at least Dr. Denman is a woman and a little bit more mature. Hello. Back again. You've really got to get a life. What about you? You're always here. This is my life. Yeah, well, one day I hope it's mine too. Maybe sooner than you think. What? Lewis, I've just received a very large research grant from a corporation to do a six-month scientific survey on an area of my choice. Really? 
Oh wow, congratulations, you really deserve I want you on my team. You and me, Lewis. It'll mean full-time work, a lot of travel, maybe even international. What do you think? Why? Well, I've I... already contacted your teachers. There's government funding available to subsidise your trip and you'll even get credit for the work. I don't know, I'll, I'll have to... Ask uh... your parents, of course. But I'll need you to make a decision tomorrow. I'll be leaving for my lab in the Galapagos Islands the day after. That's where we'll be based. Wow. Wow. That's amazing, isn't it? Well, it's certainly a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, yeah. What are you going to do? I don't know. I'm, I'm just so happy that she thinks I'm smart enough to do it. Oh, please. What? You really think she wants you for your brain? It is not like that between Dr Denman and I at all. That's not what I mean. I mean, how do you know she's not just after another sample? No, no, no. She's forgotten all about that. What do, you, what do you think I should do? Well, like you said, it's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. And it's what you've always wanted. And there's nothing holding you here. Right? Well, actually... You're right. I'm out of here. Thanks, Claire. Just add water. The phenomenon of spontaneous cellular mutation. Oh no. Cleo, what are you doing in here? Just looking for a friend. Sorry, this is off limits. Dr. Denman's orders. They're moving a lot of expensive equipment out of here today. Ah, uh, right. And Cleo? Yep. Don't let me catch you back here. like an article for a scientific journal or something. It's the same stuff as you keep blabbing about, Lewis. It proves she's still got the DNA sample. It was in a little white slide box. Well, Lewis? She wouldn't. It looked like she'd been studying it, doing tests. She's not like that. Time to face facts, Romeo. Facts? You don't have any facts. Cleo, you read a bit of an article you don't understand. I understand enough to know it's the same stuff you say. So? Maybe I've influenced her thinking. I have a very forceful personality. Ha! <laughs> Why do you think she wants me on her research trip? Did it ever occur to you that there might be a reason? Like, like she values my opinion. And you're mopping. <laughs> He's lost it, totally. Gotta find a way to get into that lab. Ah, uh, correction. You guys have to. I'm going to lose my job if I get caught in that place again. Shoot. Dr. Denman. Uh um, can you, can you be straight with me about something? Anything. <sighs> Did you hold on to that slide of mine? Yes. Like, it's not like you have to... Did you say yes? Yes, I did. It's right here with all our Mako slides. And I'm hoping someday, Lewis, you'll be a little more forthcoming about where you got it. Um... Lewis, you've got something extraordinary here. Cells that completely change their molecular structure on contact with water. It sounds... It is impossible, but here it is. I can't explain it. We need to do a lot more tests. You stole it from me. Lewis, 
I'm sorry I deceived you, but I have no intention of ripping you off. Why do you think I want you on this trip with me? Is it the charm? Lewis, do you think you could get more samples like this? What about trust? You can trust me to be a good scientist. Like I said, I believe in your talent. I appreciate that. Are you still coming tomorrow? Can I have a look at your research so far? Of course. I wouldn't miss it for the world. I didn't sleep a wink last night. Me yeah, neither. You do realise she'll eventually get it out of him, don't you? Why? Where the DNA came from. We have to get that slide back. Lewis wouldn't sell us out completely. Would he? Stop having so much faith in human nature. He already has sold us out. You're the only one who doesn't think so. Why is that? I just don't believe it. Lewis is our friend. Where are you going? I'm going to go talk to Lewis, even if it is for the last time. Well? Anybody can catch her, we can. Wait, I think that might defeat the purpose of all the secrecy, don't you? Oh, you're right. Sorry. But are we just gonna let him go like this? Like what? Well, you're just sailing away without saying, Lewis, you didn't go. Keen observation, Claire. Very, very good. You got the slide back, and she didn't suck you in? What are you serious? You think I'd buy that stuff about being a good scientist? Please. What about her records? All the stuff I saw? When she opens the file, I think she'll find it's recently been erased. Oops. No, I don't think the good doctor and I are a team anymore, guys. It's good to have you back, Lewis. Thank you.